Oh, I don't think that anybody has ever seen the real Frank Zappa because being interviewed is one of the most abnormal things that you can do to somebody else. It's the two steps removed from the Inquisition. Zappa has often seemed to be a force of cultural darkness. Bearded and gross and filthy, a lone brutal reminder of music's potential for invoking chaos and destruction. I'm famous, but most people don't even know what I do. Always a freak, but never a hippie. Frank Zappa on Frank Zappa. You're very packaging oriented, aren't you? You've got kids. Yeah, I have a wife, four kids, mortgage, the works. I've never taken any acid. I've smoked about 10 joints over a period of nine years. Isn't it strange the fantasies that people have? <laughs> I hate to see anybody with a closed mind on any topic. And then people started telling me that my melodies were ugly. <laughs> Dirty words don't exist. This is a fantasy that is manufactured by religious fanatics and government organizations to keep people stupid. God, I am the American dream with a spindle up my butt till it makes me scream. Society decides for itself what will be sinful. So a little chance of escaping that cycle. We're not concerned enough about the quality of our lives. Aesthetic enrichment, this is not a major consideration in the United States. There is a deep, permanent, irreversible cynicism in you. And I wish that I could have other people catch some of it. Mm -hmm.